Ronnie O'Sullivan is through to his 25th Masters quarter final after fighting off a spirited comeback from Ding Jung Wee. The Rocket threatened to run away with it as he went into the mid session interval 4 0 up. Ding Jung Wee found some inspiration after the break and managed to pull the match back to 4 3 after making a maximum break in the seventh frame. The Rocket responded in style with a 1 2 7 break to all but seal the tie. Another quick fire break stopped short of a century, but Ronnie was already in the 90s at this point and he took the match 6 3. I thought Ronnie looked good and considering his last official tournament was back in the UK Championships in December, he looked alright and certainly wasn't rusty. Ronnie didn't completely put his cue down over Christmas, he played in the Macau Masters late in December and he also did an exhibition with Ding. However, these were in China so he's probably suffering from a little bit of jet lag. Either way, it certainly didn't show in his performance. At the end, Ronnie was his usual self-deprecating self saying his cueing wasn't there and he felt tense at the beginning of the match. But it is the first round of a Triple Crown event, what do you expect? You've got to feel the pressure. I think Ding just let himself down in the first half of the match today. If he'd have made that 1-4-7 and say he was only 2-0 down, it would have gone 3-2 up and I think he would have gone on to win. Then four frames at the beginning, they were just too much. The Rocket will face the winner of Robertson or Hawkins in the quarterfinals. What did you make of the Rocket's performance? Let me know in the comments. Be sure to like and follow for daily snooker roundups and news. Thanks for watching.